There is a rich relationship between epilepsy and uh, experience, spiritual uh, experiences. Since uh, the epoch times, uh, we have the conception that epilepsy is a sort of trance, spiritual trance. Uh, they use it to interpret epilepsy uh, since Hippocrates it was seen as the possession by a demonic entity and this conception uh, was kept during Middle Ages and until recently in the 20th uh, century, the beginning of the, tw the 20th century, uh, there are many scientists and people with this sort of position. Uh, so it, it is important to, to differentiate epilepsy from, for instance, mediumship or another sort of spiritual experiences. And we know that there is a specific form of epilepsy, temporal lobe epilepsy, in which we can have uh, many uh, forms of spiritual experiences, such as uh, cosmological experiences, experiences of uh, all out of body, out of body experiences, uh, dis dissociation experiences, all of them related with a specific focus on temporal lobes. The, f the fact is that most of temporal epilepsies uh, don't have this sort of manifestation. In other words, uh, they are rare. Uh, in the other side of the coin, we have the fact that uh, most of the mediums, people uh, who have mediumship abilities, uh, do not have uh, epileptic seizures and do not have uh, modifications, chains in electroencephalographic uh, uh, exam. So we can uh, we cannot deal with the hypothesis that uh, mediums have any kind of epileptic uh, disorder.